Hi, my brothers and sisters in the Lord. I am so excited. Um, so much has been happening. Uh, I just have to share. Um, so uh, the lady that uh, a couple weeks ago on a video you've seen, uh, she uh, said that she had uh, had it in a dream, a prophet came to her and said that she needed to get saved. And uh, so we just heard back from her. Apparently she's been trying to get a hold of us, but somehow she's been uh, unable to, but she just got through and she said, I want to get baptized and I want to learn how to do what you guys are doing. So it's so effective, guys. It's so effective what we're out there doing on the streets and people want this and I'm so excited to. So we're doing a baptism in the morning. And um, the other thing that's so exciting, as I mentioned in the previous video, is the presence of God is now starting to be felt by people just standing nearby while we pray. So this is like a whole new thing that's starting to happen. God seems to be increasing as we are consistent and going out and healing the sick. And um, that's so exciting. And we even seen recently some people getting healed who we didn't pray for that were just standing nearby. And uh, so this is something that we're you know not used to but we're sure excited about it and uh, so we're continuing in this and loving it and guys you go out and do it god bless you so much because if you step out and do this jesus is right there with you he'll come through he'll heal the people and uh, you can preach the gospel also oh i almost forgot so uh two people in this uh video one we didn't get on video uh odette was praying for and she uh, she just got the gift of tongues right there in the streets and it was just flowing and uh and then another person that i was praying for uh you'll see in the video um she sort she got a little bit of the gift of tongues i believe she got the baptism of the holy spirit but she just had a couple words she's trying and, and so on and uh, so i'm so excited actually to hear back from her as to how that goes and uh but anyway watch the videos people are getting healed as per usual and uh, so much more is happening than just the miracles we're starting to make disciples of all these people as they get healed and saved and baptized it's just so exciting okay god bless and go do it guys you can do it hi guys uh we are so excited today we had such a blast uh, out in walmart today uh we're uh, just sitting in the parking lot after crazy crazy encounters the last encounter i didn't get it on video guys but it was so cool i'm praying for this lady who's got uh one of those walkers stabilization type walkers and uh anyway so she's got she's getting healed and her daughter is just standing there texting next to her all of a sudden she looks up and she says i feel tingling so not <laughs> only the person i was praying for feel the presence of the holy spirit so did her and then if that wasn't enough about 30 seconds later this walmart employee is walking by and she just stops and closes her eyes and i'm like uh what's going on and uh so i kept going and then when after the lady got healed then i asked her what's going on she said she said i felt the presence of god so i stopped and closed my eyes so that was like completely crazy was that awesome tony or what it was incredible <laughs> what about you guys what did you encounter so awesome Good day, really good day. Lots of people were really open. Lots of people got healed. Um, pain left. Oh, baptism healed. in the Holy Back, Spirit. Healed. Odette, it's say what happened. It's my turn. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, we met this really cool young guy, Anthony, and um, oh, yeah. he was true. really open. And I, he asked for prayer for general things. Hmm. And then I asked him if he had received the Holy Spirit when he believed, and he said he hadn't. So we explained what that meant and. I said, you know, do you want to receive the Holy Spirit right now? And of course, he allowed me to pray. And then he was praying in tongues within about a minute or so. And he was really blessed. Uh, lots of love in Walmart today. Lots of beautiful, beautiful people that Amen. were open and really needed a touch from the Lord. A lot of devastation in people's lives. And we were able to minister to that too. And yeah, it was a good day. George cried. George always cries when people get healed. Well, you gotta do that. <laughs> Not on go. camera. Here you go. <laughs> okay, listen. Guys, I want to tell you this. It is so exciting out here. God is on the streets. God is in Walmart. God is wherever you take him. 
guys, we got to get out of the churches and on the streets because these people are not coming in the churches, but they're getting healed miraculously Amen. when we go out on the streets and bring Jesus to them. This is not a come to my place gospel. This is a go gospel. Jesus said, go and make disciples of all nations. So you have a, a commandment from Jesus to go. So begin to go. If you haven't been kickstarted, get a hold of us. We'll connect you with someone or we'll kickstart you our ourselves and get you going. So God bless and begin to make disciples. Amen. Hi, I'm Doug and I'm here with Faye. And Faye, you have pain in your neck, you were saying? Yes. What's your pain level out of 10, would you say? I'll say a seven. About a seven, so that's pretty, pretty bad. Okay, so I'm going to pray for you and God's going to heal you. You ready? Okay. So neck, I command you be healed in the name of Jesus. Tendons, ligaments, and bones and vertebrae, I command you be healed right now. All pain go now. Now wait, Jesus. wait, 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 wait. Just relax, relax, relax. Okay. Now, do you feel anything going on in your neck right now? Just be very honest with me. It doesn't matter if you feel or don't. No. But... Okay. Now, I want you to check for pain. Be I'm very checking honest. for pain. Doing okay. this. This okay. is how I feel pain. Oh, okay. And do you have any pain? No. Be very honest with us. I don't have any. Okay. And do you have any other spot that needs healing? Yes, my lower back. Your lower back? My knees. Oh my goodness, yes, so you got a my lot. my wrists, my fingers, they all hurt. Yes, okay, so what, hurt, what hurts the worst right all now? All of it. Okay, we'll pick one so we can... My lower back. Your lower back, okay. So, uh, back, I command you, be healed in the name of Jesus right now. Tendons, ligaments, and bones, and vertebrae, I command you, be healed right now. In the name of Jesus. Now hold, just wait. There, Holy Spirit's flowing. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Do you feel something going on in your back? What's going on? I'm busy to see how far I can go. Oh, you can go. <laughs> I'm good. I feel good. I feel good. Okay, so is, is there any pain? Be very honest. No. Don't don't just say anything. To you. Yeah, yeah, be straight up because this is real. Okay. Now, uh, what else do you have pain? My knees. Your knees, okay. And they're hurting right now? Yeah. Okay, what's your pain level on your knees? Four. A four. Knees, I command you be healed in the name of Jesus right now. Both knees, I command you be healed. Tendons, ligaments, bones, and cartilage, be healed in the name of Jesus right now. Do you have something in your stomach? Stomach, yep. be healed yep. in the name of Jesus right now. Stomach, I command you. Be healed. Now, check and see. I need a whole ceremony for my stomach. Okay. Well, check your knees. Let's check with your knees. I tell you. What's that? I've been going through stomach pain all day. And yeah. I was feeling the pain when I was just talking to him, but I don't feel it. Me pushing it, I don't feel it. Isn't that cool? <laughs> I don't feel it. And I've been dealing with my stomach pain for the last four days. Yeah. What's your number so if you come back after you go? It, well, it's Jesus, so it's not coming back. But if it does, you call me and I'll teach you. I want to teach you how to do this. Because mm -hmm. I can tell you're a believer. Yes, I am. But um, it, it's... Are you not from Detroit? No, I'm from Windsor. I see, but, I can read. <laughs> but you can call me on the phone. I can okay. call you, or you can get me on the, on the, on the internet. Windsor is on Yeah. Phone. Okay, gracias. Hi, I'm Doug, and I'm here with Yolanda Allen. Okay, and you've got pain in your neck, you're saying? My neck, my shoulders. Your, your my neck hands. and your shoulders, and your knees? My hands. Your hands, your hands, okay. All right, so what's wrong with your hands, by the way? I don't know, I've been, well, I got shot in this hand. Oh, okay, ago, that'll do it. So. Yeah, so you got maybe some arthritis or something going on. And I pray here. Okay, so. all right. So, um, Tony, can you do the camera for me for a sec here? All right, so I'm gonna pray for your neck. You're gonna get healed. Uh, God's gonna heal you. So neck, I command you to be healed in the name of Jesus right now. Tendons, ligaments, and bones, and vertebrae, and nerves, I command you to be healed. Go back in your proper position right now in the name of Jesus, 100%, right now. There, now do you feel something going on in there? Yeah, what do you feel? What does it feel like? Come closer, Tony, I wanna to just like get her in the film. Kind of heated. A heater? Yeah. yeah like that's the Holy Spirit. He's real. Right. It's like it's heated up. Yeah. That's the Holy Spirit healing you. Okay. Now, 
tell me when the heat starts to reside, although I keep feeling waves, holy spirit. You ever felt this before? No. This oh. is God. It feels like something in my body. Yeah. This is what God, you can actually feel the presence of God. Yeah. He's real. Okay. I think you're pretty much done. Check your neck and see. It just pops. Yeah. Now check, is there any pain? No. All gone? Check your shoulders. Now, if there's like any I pain, just, you tell me. No, it feels like I just took a heating pad just off. Just took a heating pad off? It does. Aww. See, it's real. Now, you say you have pain, you have pain in your hands right yes. now? Okay. So, just turn up your hands like this. I'm just going to release Holy Spirit. It's the Spirit of God. I've been painting over your hands. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There we go. Now, you feel something going on. What do you feel? Lightness. Lightness. So that's the sickness leaving your body right now. Holy Spirit's dragging it out. And there. Wow. Feel that? <laughs> Check your hands. Oh. Is there any pain in your hands now? Check it, be really honest. All gone? Isn't that cool? Do you know why that happened? Jesus loves you, and he loves you so much that he actually died on the cross for you. For all of us have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Have you ever heard that before? And, and so we need a Savior. We need somebody. And Jesus went and died and paid the price for our sins so that we don't have to. Have you ever heard that message? Yeah. Are you a Christian? I believe in God. Oh, okay. So, so, I don't know. So what I, I just, would say Christian because it's like Matthew and okay. Christian is like the same. Yeah. So what 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 I just prayed I just prayed in Jesus' name. So he's the Son of God. Do you believe that? Yes. And he died on the cross for your sins. Do you believe that? So I made a card because you know Peter in the Bible? So when he I back of the there. On the back, I've written down four steps in Acts 2, verse 38. They asked Peter, what do we need to do to be saved? And he gave these steps. He said, you have to believe. And then he said, you have to repent, be baptized, and you receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. And so, and the Holy Spirit's what you felt. Remember the heat you felt? Oh, yeah. That's the Holy Spirit. You can actually feel him. Like, when I pray for people, I'm feeling his presence. I actually feel tingling is the way it feels to me. But different people feel it differently. It doesn't matter. It's, it's him, you know? And uh, so we repent and be baptized and the gift of the Holy Spirit. So you have to ask Jesus to forgive you is the second step. Have you ever asked them to forgive you of your sins? Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> All right. And then you have to be baptized. Are you even baptized in water? Okay. So that's the next thing you have to do because that's part of the steps that he gave. And um, so you want to do that ASAP. We're, in, we're here once in a while, but we could even get you baptized. You see we're dealing with real thing, not, yes. not just religion. Okay, and the fourth step is you get you receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. And that's that feeling that you felt. And you'll actually begin to speak in tongues in a new language. Have you ever heard of that? Yes, I heard of Yeah. I didn't see when I was little this year. Yeah. Because so I didn't know what was going yeah, on. Yeah, because you didn't know what's going on. Right, but my auntie, yeah. was, she was doing it and then she yeah. I was probably like five or six, yeah. so it really freaked me out. And yeah. my mom, I'm like, that's nothing to be scared of. Yeah, that's yeah. That's just the Holy Ghost or something. Yeah, the Holy Spirit. <laughs> Holy Ghost, yeah, it's another name for the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Did you want to receive the Holy Spirit? Yes. Okay. Mm. I'm going to pray for you right now to receive the Holy Spirit, okay? Just say, Holy Spirit, come. You don't have to do my words, just anything that comes to you. Shiki de Ababa Shay, Yadaba Shay, Shani of the Sikhi Titi Ababa. Shadi Yaba Kisiki Tiyada. Safe? Is that what you came to you? Holy Spirit's telling you you're safe. 
Okay, so now listen to see if you hear any words that are not English that just come. come. So, shava baba kisi kiti, baba baba tiri ada bate shi kiti, tiya baba baba shiri ada bate shi kiti. Just open your mouth and say something. Shari ya baba kisi kiti, ya baba baba tiri ada bate shi kiti. Shari ya baba say ya kiko kiko. And as the Holy Spirit gives you, don't listen to your mind. Let the Holy Spirit go. Shava baba kisi kiti. Tariya baba ba shariya baba si ki ti ada baba ba shariya baba ke si ki yeah there it goes there it goes shaba baba ke yeah you got it she ki ti ada baba si ti ada ya baba ke ki ti ada baba baba shariya baba si let just let the Holy Spirit flow shaba ba ke si ti ada te there we go shaba ba ke si ki ada baba ba te okay you do so now just keep going keep going let it go. Shariya baba ba ki si ki ti ti re baba ba ba she. Shariya baba ki ti ti ba ki ti ti ba she. Sometimes you only get one solo. You just have to keep going over the same thing until the Lord gives you more. Just get, just listen for what He's got for you. Shariya baba ba ki si ki ti. Holy Spirit, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. There we go. Go ahead, go ahead, shoot it out. Shariya baba ki si ki ti ti ya baba ba ba she. Shari ya ba 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 te ti ya ba 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 she ya da ba she she ba 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 ke si ki ti ti re ya ba te you got it shari ya ba ke te si ki ya ba 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 te ti ya ba te ti ya ta 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 na ma te ti ya ba 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 she ki ti ti si ki ya ba 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 te ti ya ba she ti ya ba si ki ti ya ba 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 te she ki ti shari ya ba ke si ya da ba te ki ti ti re ba 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 she. Yeah, you got it. Shababa ki si ki ti ti ababa baba she di adabate. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. 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 So you you got some words. So you just have to go home and just do that. Yeah, I know because I feel like what are sweaty. You? Yeah, <laughs> the Holy Spirit just, yeah. Yeah, it probably needs well, she, to get. got the wrong person. Well, she was the one who was praying for warm hands. <laughs> <laughs> the other friend. That's my cousin. Yeah. Uh, that's your cousin. That's awesome. So listen, so I believe you got baptized in the Holy Spirit. Sometimes you just get a few words at first. I saw, you know, you get, you're going for it and then it'll start to flow when you get back at home. And you may feel the heat come on you again or whatever as you're doing it. So go ahead and do that in your private time and start to read your Bible. Do you have a Bible? Yes, I okay. have Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so start reading it up. So you're going to find now that you have baptism, you're getting hungry for reading the Bible. Before it was like, yeah, I'll get to it, i get to it. Now it's like, I want to get to it. <laughs> yeah, I'll read it. I got certain books I yeah. like, I'll say. Yeah. Like, I like it. Mark, Matthew. Yeah. Because it was like a... I like John. I like... It was like a story that everybody was telling. Yeah. But it's different. A little yeah. different. But it was the same story. Yeah, it's the same story. And yeah. I love Job. Oh, you love Job? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Job, I love that. That's awesome. <laughs> just keep reading. And um, actually... Yeah, because a lot of stuff I don't understand. 